Welcome back to my mom life. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Jordan and today I am taking you along with me through my day. I thought that I would start, I don't know, before I put my makeup on and we could kind of just talk a little bit. Um, so I'm just going to throw on some makeup real quick. I have, oh, in just a minute, Evie, I have, I'm going to be looking this way because my mirror is over here, but I have some errands to run today. Um, I have a Walmart order to pick up, just a small one because I just did a massive grocery shopping trip. Um, and that haul will be up soon if it isn't already. So I have um, just a few things that I forgot. Evie, not yet. Okay. And then we have to return some books to the library. Um, and then Kylie starts volleyball tonight, and she told me she needs some new shorts. Some new, like, athletic shorts. So we might go try and find some of those. And then I may I you, Mama. go to the dollar store. I kissed you. Thank you, Evie. I want to go with it. Okay. I want to walk. I may go into the dollar store and just see. I want see. to walk, mommy. Okay, I mean, see what kind of spring decorations they have. I'm just really ready for spring and summer, and I thought it would be nice to decorate a little bit without spending a ton. So that is my plan. Also. Um, by the consignment shop that I thought we would look at for shorts is a TJ Maxx and I need some more of my syrup that I put in my coffee. It's the sugar-free syrup that I get there. So it's called like skinny syrup or something. So that is my plan. All, the kids are already working on their schoolwork. So hopefully they can get that done quickly so that we can get our errands started. My Walmart order is supposed to be done at 11 and that is in an hour. Um, they probably won't be fully done. But they can finish when we get home. We definitely need to return the library book. Hold on, Ev. So I am just going to finish getting ready. And then, yeah help them finish up their school that we can get done and then head out. So I thought I would take you with us. Okay, I finished my quick makeup. I'm just gonna throw on some chapstick and then I'm gonna straighten my hair real quick. It's just, it's rainy and humid out and, well, it's not humid. It's not humid, it's cold. But it's rainy and my hair seems kind of frizzy already. So just gonna run the flat iron through it and then I will be ready for the day. Let's go check on the kids and their schoolwork. Oops. Hopefully Henry is doing his math. I kind of highly doubt it. So I'm going to go check.
Okay, so I got our small little Walmart pickup order. I'll go ahead and show you what I got in the van just to get this haul out of the way because I was going to show you everything that I picked up today wherever I went. So, I got some unsweetened vanilla almond milk. I have one in the fridge. I've been eating a lot of cereal, so I've been going through the almond milk. Um, and then a bunch of, one bunch of cilantro. I picked up one of my energy drinks that I like. And then one can of tomato sauce. That goes with this enchilada sauce packet. And then when I was in Walmart the other day, I picked out some coffee, but it had a hole in the bag and I didn't realize it until I got to the register. So anyways, I didn't get it because it spilled all throughout the buggy. Um, so. I added this to my order, just this Caramel Me Crazy Dunkin'. We have um, just some plain coffee at home, the whole bean coffee, but you have to grind it. And sometimes I just want, I guess I'm just lazy. And I like, <laughs> I like flavored coffee sometimes. So I picked up this to try, let me smell it. It smells good, so we'll try it. I got a pack of um, paper plates. This is what I really needed. Whoops. I really needed a pack of pull-ups for Sawyer at nighttime. I did not realize that he was out. So I picked up one pack of pull-ups and then this was a fun thing that I grabbed. I've been wanting these. These are my favorite pens and they're erasable. I've just never bought the full set. I have a blue one. I bought like a two pack of the blue, but um, yeah, I got a tin pack these were $11 which are kind of high but I've been wanting them so I let myself get them and then let's see oh I picked up this this is kind of a uh, I took a chance on this I guess because I hadn't smelt it but it looked good oh it smells really good so like I said earlier I've been so excited for spring and summer and this warm spring sunshine smells really good and then the last thing, the last thing that I grabbed is this. This is completely random, but it is Cinnamon Toast Crunch Cinnadust Cookie Mix. My kids love Cinnamon Toast Crunch. They have a whole line out with Betty Crocker right now of different things, so I thought that I would give this a try. Okay, so that is my small little Walmart pickup order. The kids want to go in and spend some money, um, so we'll see if we do that. Henry wants the Shazam movie, and Kylie wants the Stranger Things, like, vinyl record, the music. So, I don't know if they have it. It says online that they don't, but we've seen it in there before, so we'll see. Um, but, yeah, that's my Walmart haul. Now I am going to go into Dollar Tree. We did end up going in for the kids to spend some of their money. Kylie got... <gasps> She recently got a record player for her birthday and she is newly obsessed with Stranger Things. So she got the Stranger Things record. So that is exciting. And then Henry. Don't don't watch Stranger Things. Watch Shazam. It's the best. Henry bought Shazam with his money. So we picked up those two things as well. Okay, we went into one of the Dollar Trees around us. The one that I normally go in, like the best one around here, is closed today for some reason. So I ran into the one by the consignment shop and it's pretty crappy. So I'm going to run into another one on my way to the library. We went into the consignment shop and found Wait, a few I things. I go in the library. Okay. Um, I will show you what I got at the consignment shop when we get home. Um, we found okay we found some good deals and then I ran into TJ Maxx just now I did a little clip they didn't have much spring decor um, but they had a few things um, so yeah I did get what I went in there for and I forgot that I had like a merchandise credit in my wallet so I didn't even have to pay for it I mean I did but I used that merchandise credit that I had for returning something a while ago so that was awesome so now I think we're going to go to the other Dollar Tree and maybe Dollar General, it's right next door, and then to the library.
Okay, I am back home now from running all of our errands. I feel like I ran around ragged trying to find good mm. Dollar Trees and Dollar Generals. They really were crappy today. So I'll show you everything I got though. I did find some cute stuff at Dollar General and I did run into the commissary, which is the grocery store on base yeah, while I was there because they are the only ones that have my favorite ice cream and I will show you what that is now. So at the commissary, I needed cake flour because I am making a specific recipe for my channel. Um, it's a copycat recipe. I'm kind of trying to make like a series of copycat recipes. My last one I just did was the Auntie Anne's Pretzel Bites. Those are so, so good. If you haven't seen that, definitely check that video out. I also grabbed two cake mixes just to have in the pantry. I have an idea for those and these jelly beans are to go along with that. So I picked up some jelly beans. I did pick up a drink while I was in there. Two um, cans of, yeah, two cans of frosting. I needed some neon food coloring, so I picked that up at the commissary and then um, some rainbow sprinkles and these little cute, they reminded me of like spring flowers, these sprinkles. So, sorry if the lighting looks dark. It is super dreary and rainy out today. Um, the last few things I got at the commissary were, like I mentioned, my ice cream. This is my favorite ice cream ever. <laughs> Um, and so the only place I can get it is at the commissary, the oatmeal cookie kind. They sell Halo Top other places, but the oatmeal cookie kind, if you find it, grab it because it is so, so good. And then I needed some oil, so I picked that up. And then just a pack of vanilla and chocolate pudding. I always put those in with my cake mixes. Put it down, Ev. And then I already showed you what I got at Walmart, just almond milk coffee all of these things you already saw in the van the wax melt cilantro and pull-ups and then this energy drink at tj maxx i got three of my skinny syrups these um i love to put in my coffee in the morning and i have the pumps i ordered the pumps off of amazon so i have them by my coffee pot i picked up mocha these are i think 3.99 yeah, $3.99. And like I said in the car, um, I had a merchandise credit, so I didn't even have to pay out of pocket for these. Vanilla almond, and then butter toffee. Now for Dollar Tree, I really was hoping to find more stuff at Dollar Tree, but the ones that I went to just didn't have um, much. So we found this cute little welcome sign with the bunnies. I did find these. Um, flower picks and um, this little happy Easter sign which I think is super cute and then this one Everly really likes this one she wants to put it on her door right Evie uh -huh. you like that bunny mm -hmm. and that's what I was thinking when I bought that too so she loved that and that is everything that I got at the Dollar Tree like I said I went to three or four different ones and they just yeah didn't have much so then I went to Dollar General. The first one um, was a bus. The second one had a few things. I found this little Happy Easter sign. No, no. And it was a dollar. See, it since Dollar Tree's prices went up, you can find some cheaper things at Dollar General now because everything at Dollar Tree is now $1.25. Anyways, that is super cute. Don't touch it, okay? The glitter will come off. Then I found this big, um, it's actually pretty heavy, $4 wooden sign and it says gather with the yellow flowers. I thought it would look pretty on the mantle maybe. We got two of these white sandalwood candles. Kylie really liked the scent and so did I, so she wanted to put one in her room. But it's just a white um, glass candle i think it was seven dollars i'll double check if i can find the receipt but it smells like clove and brushed suede it says it smells really really good yeah i also found this it's kind of coming apart i'm gonna have to fix it but this little sign that says um farm shop sausages and bacon i thought it was really cute there was also one that had a cow on it with milk it said like fresh milk or something it wasn't as cute though so we picked up this to put probably in the kitchen on top of the cabinet. 
And then we found this piggy. It says piggy. oink, yeah. And I thought maybe this could go in my tear tray. I don't know. He's cute. Found this little birdhouse. This was $3.50. Oh, this sign, let me show you, was $6. Did I show you that? Yeah. $6. The pig was 4 Then I got this little chick. I thought that the kids would like that. It was $3. And then Kylie found me this little watering can. Um, it was $7. I thought that was kind of high. No, no, no. But... She liked it and she thought that we could put some flowers in it. So we picked up two bunches. This one, it's really pretty in pink. And then this cream, whoops, this cream bunch. And these were $5 each for the flowers. Let me get my cold stuff put up and then I wanna show you what we picked up at the consignment store. Okay, here is my pile of things that we found at the consignment store today. We spent a total of 30, no, no. $38.27, but we got some things on, yeah, like $5.40 of that was discount. So we got these Kylie Needs Volleyball Shorts. So we found these, what brand are they? Velocity? I don't know. But they have the like biker shorts underneath and um, they're just lightweight and they were, Four dollars. Everly's over there shaking sprinkles if you hear that. These were a good find. These were airy shorts. She loves airy. Um, they're biker shorts, but they'll be good to play volleyball in. And they were anything with this red sticker, oh sorry, red stamp was 20% off. So eight dollars, 20% off, and they are the airy brand, so that's a really good deal. I found me this t-shirt. It looks a little big. It might be kind of oversized. Now that I'm seeing it, it is a large. I'm kind of more of a medium, but that's okay. It's super cute with these flowers. And it was only, let's see, $4. And it's from Old Navy. And then I was looking for some workout tank tops or just workout tops in general and found this um, Dan Skin tank and it was $7 with 20% off. And then this kind of like a sage green one was from the Athletic brand, Athletic Works I guess is the brand. And it was $6 with 20% off and it's just a Razorback. The other one, I'll show you the other one, the back of the other one. So this is the back of this one. And then this gray one, that's the back. Hopefully you can tell, I'm trying to do this quickly because we are going to the gym. And then I found this one, this was a good buy. It is a Nike um, tank and it was $6. It's just gray and it is a Razorback as well I have been needing some sort of zip up hoodie that's kind of lightweight this is like windbreaker material and um, it was on sale it was 20% off of six bucks so I mean you can't beat that and it's the BCG brand I can't remember is that Academy or is that I don't remember I don't know it's the like store brand somewhere but it is pretty good quality. It looks perfect. I don't see any stains or anything. So this will be good transitioning into spring. So yeah. Yeah. He is happy to be home. Yeah. So that is everything that I got at Plato's Closet. Like I said, we went in for shorts for Kylie for volleyball. I wish we would have found some more. But um, we might go back because on Friday, I think everything with this red, that one doesn't have it, but everything with the red um, stamp on it is going to be like 50% off. So we may go back. Yeah, we may go back on Friday and see what else we can find. I was kind of in a rush with the little kids and everything. So 
that is my haul for today. I hope that you enjoyed shopping with me. I tried to get some clips in the store. Now I have to put all of this away and then we are going to run to the gym. And then when we get home from the gym, I think I will show you where I put all of our little spring decorations. Okay, before I close out the vlog, I wanted to go ahead and show you where I ended up putting everything. Um, and then also a couple, well, only one thing that I already had. I really only had one thing. So on the front door, ouch, I have this. Let me turn the camera around. This bow needs to be fixed like majorly. And actually I may go back to Dollar Tree because they had some really cute ribbon and I should, I'm gonna get Hi. different ribbon because that looks terrible Hi. now that I'm looking at it through the camera. And then on my front door, I have this that I've had. It's kind of plain and simple, but it's, it's so cute for Easter and I got it at Target years ago. So it's just like these felt little Easter eggs, super cute. And I think it looks great on our blue door. Watch out, Rex. So I did that. And then over here, this is the girls' hallway. And we have these little command hooks on the doors here. Um, I really use room. It's a mess. Let's just close that. So yeah, and on, throughout the holidays, I changed them out. So. For Easter, Evie wanted, Evie wanted this one on her door, and then this is the bathroom door, and then this is Kylie's door. So we changed those out, but I think it's cute. You can see this through in the kitchen, and I don't know. I just think it's cute for $1.25. And then this little um, shelf over here, I need to brighten it up some more. The only thing I added was this little birdhouse that I got today, and then a few blue sprigs from the um, Dollar Tree flowers that I got. So there's that little pop of color. No, no, Evie. So we need to add some more over here, but this shelf just houses some pictures. Uh, it looks kind of messy, so I might need to tidy that up. Yeah. And then over here. Oh. There's <laughs> um, On the mantle, I just wanted little things. Obviously, I am not some, this is not pottery, pottery Barn catalog, you know, material, but um, I think it's cute. So I put this little gather sign here, a couple sprigs of um, the blue flowers, as well as over here with our little chick and then my little candles that I have up there all the time. And then over here, I put that watering can with some of our flowers back up, and then my new candle, and then our happy Easter sign. So I think that this corner looks super cute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 And then on my stairs, going down my stairs, um, there's toys and stuff on there, but we have this ledge here and I just put some flowers in this copper, little copper pitcher that I have on here. And these candles are always here. Also could add some flowers or something, or some more color here, but there's that. And on top of my kitchen cabinets, I have this window that is always here with these flowers. And I added that farm sign up there and then our little pig. So that's where those ended up. So yeah, that is where I ended up placing everything. Once you spread it out throughout your house, it seems like you didn't get much at all. Um, so, but that's okay. I think it adds just enough and I may pick up a few more things here and there and then switch out some things for summer when we get there. But yeah, thank you so much for going with me today on my errands. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe and stick around and I'll see you on my next one. Bye guys.